Bentley is known for its depth and breadth of technologies. We're in practically every aspect of infrastructure. And uh, what smart geometry to me is, it's kind of a, a juxtaposition of like, you know, uh, new emerging technologies and, you know, what's pragmatic in the real world. And what my job is kind of to do is try to say, well, I can help you get there a lot faster by using our tools in a kind of a different way than maybe most people would use it. This is my first time at Smart Geometry. And my first observation is that it's, it's, a, it's a perfect setting for a guy like me. Uh, I'm a techie at heart. And uh, when I first learned that they were using things like the Arduino chips to be able to uh, simulate, you know, physical objects, you know, by running them through computer uh, programs, I knew it was a perfect setting uh, for someone like me and someone like me that has kind of the vision or the direction to kind of, you know, push the envelope of our products. And so I saw some of these clusters that uh, some of these groups were working on and, you know, the college kind of hours of working day and night and, you know, uh, keeping anything they can put in their bodies to keep them up and it's a fantastic setting and uh, the display of the results was just absolutely amazing and I think what's great is that from the videos I've seen in the past or observations in the past seven or eight years ago you see some of the things that they've done eight or nine years ago even ten years ago now actually coming into fruition in actual buildings that you see in the world today so things that we thought were science fiction-y are now actually, you know, being developed or constructed. Um, and that's fantastic to know that some of these things that we're working on today, probably seven, eight years from now, will also uh, follow the same trend. What they were trying to do here with this particular uh, building is uh, they were trying to solve the problem of aesthetics, environment, uh, daylighting, shadowing, energy efficiency, uh, egress, uh, pedestrian simulation, structural, and they were really trying to figure out how the behaviors of each of those vertical disciplines affects, you know, another. Uh, so it's extremely exciting to see and actually be a part of, um, you know, a building that was done using some of the methodologies we're, we're putting forward.